the Burman versus the board of relegated enterprises uh, battle is you know getting more aggressive uh, with the latest allegations coming from the Burman family uh, which alleged that uh, nearly 2.15 crore ESOPs were allowed or granted to, to Rashmi Saluja who is the chairman and managing director of relegated enterprises. Uh, this was done uh, through grant of ESOPs and uh, uh, in uh, uh, basically relegated Finvest. Uh, the ESOPs uh, on conversion uh, would be equivalent to 8% equity in the NBFC arm. Uh, this entire allegation has been put by the Burman family against uh, the board of uh, relegated enterprises and the independent directors, which uh, has been, uh, you know, uh, you know, refuted by the board and the independent directors, uh, claiming that it is uh, very, it, it is, it is, these claims are without any evidence. In fact, uh, the board had come out with a statement earlier, which said that uh, the permission was uh, uh, pro, uh, taken from the shareholders of uh, relegated Finvest. Also, they had informed the shareholders of relegated enterprises on September one uh, through B and the entire uh, approval of uh, this ESOPs was done at the AGM which was held on September 26th of, uh, of, of last year uh, and though uh, the grants have been approved by the shareholders uh, it hasn't, hasn't been brought in front of the NRC which is a nomination and remuneration committee and so no fresh shares have been issued and there is no violation of SEBI's takeover, takeover regulation. Now this is a, this fight has been going on for a couple of months uh, and it started off uh, ever since uh, the Bowman family mounted an open offer to get control of uh, relegated enterprises.